guys i just left the work earlier and i'm headed home oh this is a bad angle but i'm headed home and i feel like i'm starving so hopefully when i go home i can find something to eat i don't know because i don't think there's any food there because last night i cooked but food that i cooked last night <laughs> was lunch today and dinner last night so that there is none of that left like that's so done done so but um i'm i think i should be able to find something light to eat this weekend is a holiday so i don't think i'll be doing any cooking or maybe i still will because going into the next week like i do work <laughs> some days behind each other because i requested specific days off and then the days that i requested off i'm not even sure if i'm gonna be able to do what i initially requested the days off to do so i'm gonna have to check on that tomorrow too because i went and did a drug test and the people were supposed to send it to the facility and they have not and the lady at the facility is just like yeah so call them or like come tomorrow so i guess i'll see tomorrow but i'm so upset guys welcome or welcome back to my channel so ran a few errands today went to the grocery store back home and then i'm gonna go back on the road again because Jody and i are meeting up and we have some stuff to do so guys i was saying earlier that i woke up and um and i woke up from like eight o'clock ran to the facility to drop something off did that and then i went straight to the grocery store came back from the grocery store and packed the groceries and i was made breakfast and then um now i'm literally sitting down waiting on jody to be ready because we're supposed to be meeting to go on the avenue and i want to buy another pair of scrubs but she really is out here big tripping because every time she keeps pushing it back like 30 minutes or so let me message her real quick girl I am done with making plans with you because you do not know how to keep time. At first, it was 10 o'clock. Last night, it was 10 o'clock. Now, it was 12 o'clock. Now, it was 12.30. Now, it's 1 o'clock. Like, you have to get it together with the timing. Don't nobody have no time because we're going down there for a couple of hours. You need to get it together or 1 o'clock. Her ass is out here talking about some 1 o'clock. I'm going to make sure that I'm leaving here it's 12 o'clock right now it's 11 52 but like 12 15 or like 12 30 because i can't and the sun is getting hotter like the more the day is progressing and i just feel like it's too much too much way too much i was wearing jeans just now and i definitely took that off and like found me a pair of leggings because it's too hot for all that honestly i want to see if i can get like a pair of shorts today or a couple of pairs of shorts or so because i was gonna buy them on shein but it's so much on Shein that I feel like I want. So I'm just like, no, let me, I should leave this alone. So definitely want to go on the Ave and do that and then buy the scrubs. But for the most part, those are the only two things that I'm trying to buy right now. Because um, this week I bought a pair of like slippers from Sam Edelman. And that's not going to get here until mm, one, two, three, maybe in the next four days or so. Yeah, so I'm definitely going to have to wait to see what is up with that. But that's what I want to do. And I definitely want to spend the day outside of the apartment. Because honestly, every one of my day offs, I'm inside here. And we're changing that around a little bit. Of course, we're staying safe. I have my mask and my bag and everything. So yeah. Hi guys. So today, I left here at closer to 1 o'clock. And right now, it's 8.09. So I was out for approximately like 7 hours. And... I bought some stuff, mainly for the kids, but I'm going to show you guys what I bought while I take the tags off of them. So I bought this um, nightgown set for Dijonay. I bought this, this cute little set with this, um, what do you call this, like this jumper and this top. I bought that for Jayla. I think that's going to be really, really cute on her. This is also for Dijonay this nightgown and this one came together the pink and the blue came together as a set 
I think it was for $4.99. I will, this jump set was for like $16. Um, Burlington was having a sale, like so much off, 25 to 50% off. I bought this set of three leggings for Jayla. And then when I was leaving, the guy forgot to take the thing that makes this store, the store's um, buzzer go off, off of so many of these pieces. And I'm just like, bro, you had one job. Just take the thing off. So this is a set of like three for like um, $8 or so. This is also for Jayla because she's tiny. Well, big but tiny. I bought me this cute little top. And this top was for $7.99. And I think they were having 50% off of women items. Cute little top with like rouging on the sides. And then, so I bought two nightgown sets for Dijonay. This one, a dress, you know, because they go to bed every night, according to my friend. And then this one has like shorts and a little top. I guess from like the summertime where it's like hotter. Super cute. She's really into unicorns and stuff like that right now. I really made sure that I did not go inside of the home decor section because I'm just like, oh no. Everything is good inside here. Like, I don't need anything else. I ended up spending about $100 in total. I bought these wax jeans with like buttons going all the way up, which I love. And these wax jeans were for $40. This is now rainbow. Because these wax jeans I've bought on Fashion Nova before for so much more. So I was very excited when I realized that rainbow had them for less. Love that. We love saving so I didn't really buy much for myself. I bought this top from Rainbow also. It's similar to the white one just now with, with the rouging on the sides. So I love that. But this one is um, sleeveless. What else do I have here? I bought this shoe in Marshalls. What's funny is I didn't even try it on. I mean, obviously it is my size. But I did not try it on. So this is the moment of truth. Oh, fits nicely and it's this tan what is this brown color love this I don't really have any shoes in this color and it's so comfortable like it's so soft and this was for $16 so this was a steal I mean we all know that and this was marked down like all the way down from what it was before so I'm trying to see what it was before probably in the 30s but you know love Marshalls so I bought this and I love this I think that's really all oh, I bought two jeans this jeans I also bought, I bought this inside of, um, where did I buy this? Marshalls. I bought this in Marshalls for $12.99 and I've seen it in Rainbow for the same amount. I do not even know if this one fits me. I mean, um, Jo tried them on and they fit her nicely and we today realized that we pretty much wear the same, we could pretty much wear the same sizes and bottoms. I guess it depends on how much it stretches. So, so far, I bought two jeans for myself and two tops and, like, the shoe. And then I bought some chocolates, some Jamaican chocolates. Cocoa Crisp, love that. And then what else do I have here? So, as much as I wanted to, like, cut my eye past, like, the home decor section, I also bought an umbrella in Burlington because the umbrella, uh, Marshalls, because the umbrella that I had... I've had it for about two and a half years at this point, or maybe two years, or maybe a year and a half. I've had it for a long time, okay, at this point. So I needed a new one because the insides of mine was starting to rust. And the other day when it was pouring down, I realized that it was like dripping, leaking. So I bought a new umbrella. And then I bought this um, runner type of rug for inside of the bathroom. I bought this in a random store, and this was $11.99. Because I like when it's long, because alongside my shower is um there's a long like stretch so i absolutely love this one and i bought a black and gray one because this would go with uh, you know the different types of shower curtains that i have and like the bathroom um mats i bought these um magnet clips for like chips or whatever who knows at this point because i always have like some chips open and then I don't eat all of it and then it goes bad because I don't have anything to like keep it sealed until like I'm ready to eat it again. So I have those. 
And those apparently can go in the refrigerator because they're magnetic. And then I bought this because I, I recently bought, I recently bought, um, like a charging station for my watch, my phone, and my AirPod. And so, um, I need to plug three things in and you know, the standard plugs have like two. So I bought that for there and I was looking to buy one on Amazon that was more expensive. I bought three of the candy. And then I bought this candy. This is um, a candy that I used to eat back in Jamaica. So when I see Jody picked it up first, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I haven't seen those in so long. Lately, I've really been having like a little candy craving. It's like small pills. So love these. And that that's really all I bought today. The taste of this candy is reminding me of when I was growing up. However, that's all that I bought today. I spent around a hundred dollars or maybe a little bit over and um jody spent around the same amount too because we pretty much bought similar items here and there but um yeah it was a good day a very productive day a very long one <clears throat> but productive nonetheless because we haven't been out shopping in a hot ass minute so this is all needed anyways i'm gonna end the vlog here thank you guys for watching I hope you guys enjoy the vlog and I'll see you guys in the next one.